Welcome back to White Mountains Today. I'm joined in studio with Matt Milliken from Knockerball. How are you? Good. Thank you for having us back. Yeah, of course. Um, so can you tell us a little bit about what Knockerball is, what you guys offer? Absolutely. Um, so we have a location in town uh, that we opened about two months ago and have had a great start to uh, even a slow season here in, uh, in the valley. Um, but we've got two activities down there, the first being Knockerball. Knockerball are... Uh, what we do is we use these big inflatable bubble balls uh, where you get in and you're, you're contained everything from your head down to about your a little bit lower than your waistline. And we play different games like full contact soccer, um, musical chairs, which we modify with hula hoops instead of chairs. Um, other games like uh, capture the flag, a modified version of football, sharks and minnows and uh, a, a whole other list of things and mm -hmm. basically the idea is we have we have a lot of fun in these giant balls where um, anyone from the age of about four years old up can play and um, you know it, it's uh, some of the games have a lot of contact some of the games have a little less contact and the idea is just to have a lot of fun so I've got that activity <clears throat> the second activity that we have is archery tag and Archery tag is basically like paintball style play mm -hmm. with bows and arrows. Oh, wow. So you don't have the paint, you don't have the same pain of paintball, the right. same sting <laughs> there. So it's a little bit more appropriate for children. Um, and that starts at probably about seven to eight years old, I'd say. It's not so much an age more than a size. You have to be able to pull back on the bow. And in archery tag, we use uh, recurve bows with a 25 pound pole on them and basically have a 30 yard course indoors uh, that we set up full of inflatable bunkers that you know we have two teams spread out on each side kind of going after one another uh, and playing games like uh, you know regular elimination games we call team deathmatch uh, capture the flag some modified versions of those and uh, we incorporate different things like the targets that we have and scoring options and respawns you know for our video game enthusiasts out there uh, and have a lot of fun Okay, great. Um, can you actually tell us about um, your facility? It's pretty impressive from what I've heard. Yeah, yeah. So we <clears throat> decided to do something really unique here in the Valley. We don't have a turf facility, uh, I think, within an hour's reach uh, of the area. So we try to create something, uh, obviously, for our own activities, but also to you know have something in the Valley that we could bring other activities to. So mm -hmm. We have a 7,000 square foot facility down by uh, down in Conway Marketplace, which is kind of almost right in the Conway, North Conway line. It's right next to Bee's Cafe. And in there we put in 5,000 square feet of artificial turf. Wow. It's uh, athletic grade, real artificial turf, not the stuff that you would buy at like Home Depot or Lowe's, you know, it's real <laughs> right, stuff. It's the real stuff. Yeah, and put in a whole bunch of netting and, and everything. And in there basically we have two fields, one set up for knocker ball, one set up for archery tag so that we can have both going simultaneously having as many as 20 to 24 people playing split between the two activities mm -hmm. at one time. Um, also in the facility, we've got you know plenty of room in the front with a small arcade, so stuff to keep the family or the kids busy while you're waiting either for your spot or you know just kind of mixing in. Uh, we've also got a party room in the back that we can fit as many as 20 to 30 people in for different private groups, birthday parties, things of that nature. Mm -hmm. um, so it's a, it's a pretty good spot. We have a lot of fun there. And um Aside from the um, facility, don't you also do, I think, mobile like events? You can bring absolutely. your knocker, like balls <laughs> yeah. to, to people. Yeah, absolutely. So we started as a mobile operation. Mm -hmm. For a year and a half, we did things with a lot of parks and rec programs, uh, you know, traveling to birthday parties, large events, corporate events, fundraisers. We do a lot of fundraisers. Um, so uh, we did that for the first year and a half, and we do travel. As we get into the summer, uh, we're going to be spread pretty thin w between a few different places. Mm -hmm. So we're going to be doing less traveling. The, the traveling that we'll be doing will be for larger events. Mm -hmm. uh, the reason for that is obviously we'll have our location going into the busy season, but we'll also be at Cranmore. So one of the exciting things also to announce today is that we kicked off our summer with Cranmore Mountain Resort. We have a, uh, uh, we're included on the daily ticket pass down at Cranmore, so you can play knocker ball there as well. Great. It's a little bit more streamlined offering there um, than the location, but just as much fun. And one of the things that we have at Cranmore that we don't have at our location is our inflatable knocker ball arena, oh, okay. <laughs> um, which is this 80 by 40 WWE looking like inflatable arena that's really cool, yeah. has that wow factor. 
Uh, so we're included in the daily ticket there. So Cranmore's been great to us. We had a, a great season with them last year and are there for full daily operations uh, this year. So we're excited about that. So we'll be at Cranmore Mountain um, on the weekends up until June 16th, and then they start into their daily operations. And then once we uh, get to June 16th, we're there seven days a week. Great. And we'll have our location going seven days a week right now. And are you also able to join like a league or like come in like with a group regularly? Yeah, so one of the things that we, we're introducing right now, we're gonna be putting out formal announcements this week on our Facebook page and uh, sending out blast emails to all the contact customers that we have uh, is we're gonna be announcing an archery tag league, um, kind of the, a new recreation league to hit the valley. Mm -hmm. We're really excited about it. It's uh, what we're going to do is clear off the whole field that we have and set up a really, really large archery tag uh, playing course. And our, our goal is to have nine teams of five people. And you can have more and sub, in, sub people in and right. sub out. And the idea is to have a five-week season with a two-week double elimination tournament at the end to decide the champion. Mm -hmm. Uh, and the five week season basically it'll be similar to other leagues that we have here like softball and flag football and things where you come in for about an hour and you'll play on and off uh, against one or two other teams that you know whoever you're facing that week um, and you'll do that for five weeks in a row and then go into the tournament based on seeding depending upon how you fare during the, uh, the regular season okay. so we're really excited about it. I think archery tag is uh, actually going to be bigger than knocker ball. Wow. Uh, it kind of spans a larger demographic, and you can play it longer. It's right. not as tiring. <laughs> There's a little bit more strategy involved. So the uh, the archery tag league, I think, is going to be a really big hit for anyone who's looking for something fun and active to do, you know, during the week. Right. And is there also opportunity, say, like a few friends of mine come up, and we just want to drop in and play some knocker ball or archery tag? Absolutely, great question. So the you, you can we have. Private party packages, uh, you know, ready to go for any event, large and small. But our big hitter is certainly what we call our open play or normal ticket. And you can come in at any time. Uh, and, you know, just like you were going to a movie, pay the price for a ticket. We've got ticket prices ranging from $15 up to $30, depending upon how long and how many activities you want to play. Mm -hmm. um, and that, that price is per person. And uh, with that, like I said, you can come in at any time or you can call ahead and make your reservation. And we strongly encourage that because if you come in and the field's full, you'll have to wait. Right. But we take reservations for all that. And especially, uh, you know, th this weekend being Memorial Day weekend, a lot of people up here, the weather's not cooperating as much outside. So we're something that's a lot of fun exactly. to do. We that's can bring perfect. the family in and uh, have a lot of fun. Great. Is there anything else um, coming up that you guys wanted to share with us? No, we're, we're uh, gearing up for the summer, basically. Yeah. Uh, our hours are going to change as uh, schools start to let out so that we're open seven days a week, similar to our weekend hours right now, which are 11, to, 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's really the big announcement. You know, we're, we're looking to get the word out there. We're still a brand new business and, and trying to educate people on what we are and what we do. We haven't had a person come to our facility leave without a smile on their face <laughs> right. yet. So. Um, I know uh, I know it's a lot of fun, and now we're just trying to get the word out. Great. And um, do you have a website that people can visit? We do. Uh, so the website is knockerballnorthconway.com, and we also have pretty much everything else um, you know that we post on our website also on our Facebook page. And anytime we run a promotion or anything, uh, we, we do stuff uh, typically on the weekends or midweek specials. Uh, we're definitely putting that up on our Facebook page. So. Anyone who's interested in seeing those, uh, go to our page, like it, and you know, you, you'll know you get the feed on different stuff that we're doing. Okay, great. Well, thank you so much for coming on with us again. We always love having you here. Uh, Matt Milliken from Knockerball. Again, uh, create a league, plan a birthday party. I actually have a birthday coming up, so maybe I'll get a Knockerball. Come on in. We'll get Chris <laughs> down there. We'll videotape yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> that would be great. Yeah. Entire White Mountains today. Absolutely. Uh, league to start. Great. Well, thank you so much for coming on. Thanks a lot. Um, up next, we have an event, sorry, an event report coming on after the commercial. If you just stay tuned.